Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. I'm Peter Drury and providing analysis and expert opinion alongside me will be Jim Beglin. Thanks for the intro, Peter. I've been soaking up the atmosphere and I'm really looking forward to what lies in store. Two starting lineups. He's made on the ball. It's a loose ball. Zenit St. Petersburg can't seem to retain possession. Michael. Tries a through ball. Shade too heavy. People can pick that up. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Javi Garcia tried to play it through. I timed this run brilliantly, and I think he has every right to be a little annoyed with, with the passer then, and I think he's letting him know right now about that. Just a little more behind him was needed. Hulk! Big relief, it just needed better contact. What an effort that was. He's done very well from that distance. Anyukov has a long pass towards the front. Looks to slip it through. It's Hulk. Hulk on a strong run down the right. There are a few waiting for it. Shoots! Well, he would surely have scored there more times than not. Danny looking up to see who wants it. Other side yet able to force a breakthrough here. Oh, he's found him in space! Backed up. <laughs> and that's a throw. Sets the throw, that's well read. Bitzel. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Long and high towards the flank. Oh, flags up, he must have been offside. Charges in. We sit high. Shoots!
sides a bit lacking in intent. Chorluka. Thrust towards the front line. Tavi Garcia. Danikov. Hulk. Lovely feet. Looking for a decent ball in. Anyukov. Corner it is then. And the referee has brought play back and showed him a yellow card. Petersburg, the breakthrough strike. Great corner, and he did the rest. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. Then at St. Petersburg, break the deadlock. Well, that lifts some of the pressure, but they need to maintain their work rate. It's been very good up to now. Javi Garcia, shows the route one option. Kukurin! Garcia, that's really nice. Now, what next? It's anyone's ball. Danger averted for now. And it's Javi Garcia. He's made sure that that won't get through. Hulk, a chance to play it in. And that really should have hit the net. Right in front of the goal like that, he's gone and missed it. I won't have to tell him that's not good enough. Left him on the seat of his pants. Clearance and very necessary. Javi Garcia. And he's made certain that won't get through. Samadov. So they got the only goal to make it 1-0. Another piece of really good defending. Danny, and it's long and forward. Hulk, nicely controlled. Danny delivers the ball. And in it goes! Two up and threatening to pull clear. It's a pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Look, you can only exploit the space if the pass is good enough. And in that instance, it was instinctive and quick and it did the damage.
said it's in Petersburg. Got themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, at 1-0, this contact. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Is it in? They are rampant! And already they're looking to run away with it. Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. Ziuba just knew instinctively where the ball was going to end up. That's clearly been worked on on the training ground, and the understanding is, is pretty exceptional between them, and it was beautifully worked. Then it's St. Petersburg take a three-goal lead and they are romping out of sight. Fine defending there. Cochran with the ball through. And back out it comes. Toshito. Played into the middle. It's well blocked and back out it comes. This could fall anywhere. And he should have made it four. He knows very well he can score from that distance. Not quite this time. Oh, the ball's come loose! immediate danger loose ball, who's going to get there? and it's half time here is at St Petersburg very much in control here three up and cruising Away again. Now it's Hulk. Passes it through. Kokurin. That is a class save. He had to be at his best. Well, he was right in front of goal and he probably should have scored to be fair. Gone a long way up and away, and it's Danny Michael. Danny Javi Garcia looks like a good ball through, oh, managed to get it away. Shot a goal. Witzel, comes it out wide, and it's Kokorin. Lovely bit of skill. Hulk! 
And the ball's come out. They've done it! They are running riot! He was really quick to react to the initial save, and he has his reward. But that's one of the first things you learn, whether you're a striker or not. Just anticipate a goalkeeping parry or spillage, and sometimes you'll get lucky, it'll come your way. He snaffles his third, and that earns him the match ball. Well, he's been the outstanding player on the pitch and devastating in front of the goal. What a display, what a player. Then it's in Petersburg, totally rampant here. Michael. Hefty challenge, but fair enough. Oh, he's got that all wrong, and it's a penalty. Then it's in Petersburg, have conceded a penalty here. Oh, no messing about, it is red. The players protesting furiously, but there's little or no sympathy from the ref. as calm as you like well that's the way to take a penalty stand up pick your spot and blast it home Danny takes control of enemies on the move. Sum it off. Tries a through ball. Hulk. Can he find a finish now? Really well taken goal. Hulk did well there. He was onto it in a trice. Oh, look, there's only one player who merits all the praise for that. Not only did he finish it, but his instincts for being where he was are absolutely top notch. Then it's in Petersburg, tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. It's come loose. 60 minutes played. Hulk. Now it's Hulk. Danyukov. Moves it over to the other flank. Played out to the wing. Looks to slip it through. Lombards. Toshito. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. change here there's a man waiting to come on that was very very close he was just offside oh, 
They've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Aimed long and direct. Very well to intervene. Oh, he's come flying in. Out to the flank. Another chance from a corner. And Cochrane knocks it away. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? And it's Danny. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Now the pass. He's found his man. Played out wide. Kokorin. Fushito goes for the cross. Fushito. That'll be a throw. There's some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Well, for me, this was the obvious substitution. He'd become just a little jaded, and as a result of that, he was most likely to make a mistake. I think sometimes when the body becomes tired, the brain goes with it, and I think that's happened in this case. Off. Danny, loose ball, who's going to get there? Danny, Witzel, Prosciutto passes it through, played it early. Loose, who's getting there? Samadov. Danny with the foul. And it's Cochrane. Now the pass. For a corner. Up for a header! And he spooned it over the bar. That is a poor kick by the keeper, being intercepted. Well, he would surely have scored there more times than not. It's been a possession, this, but very little to show for it. Aim forward. Samadov. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. It's there! Given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. I just think there was too much ball watching. Uh, nobody's really looking to see who's drifting into good striking positions, and it's a bad one to give away, it really is. Four in the game, he is the man. Petersburg totally rampant here. 
Michael. Looking to force his way through. Danikov. Danny. Balls out on the left now. Decent progress down the left. Anyukov is the guilty party there. <laughs> Tony Garcia. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. Zenit St. Petersburg, very much the dominant side, almost the only side. Every time they got on the ball, they looked like scoring. It is a landslide. Well, what are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? Listen, there was a real concentration on wider attacking outlets and they got their tactics spot on. They found a vulnerability and played on it to the full. It was clever and superbly executed. And, you know, it was a real risk and reward approach that gave them the crucial advantage. Well, that's the lot for now. Thanks to you, Jim, and goodbye.